If it's trash, turn it off. But if it has value, please share it out for me. Of course, it's brought to you by MaxEffortMuscle.com. For all your supplement needs, go to Max Effort Muscle. All right, Daily Fire, episode 320, worry versus concern. Is there a difference in that? I was thinking about this today because my wife is more of a worrier and I'm more of a guy that gets maybe concerned sometimes and here's why I'm gonna tell you why. So my grandpa one time told me, uh, he was seeing me uh, think about something he was like, are you worried about it? And I was like, I don't know a little bit, why? He's like, you know, worry and don't do nothing, right? And I was like, I call him Papa, his name is Frank Boone. I said, Papa, why? what do you mean by that? He goes, well, you can worry about it and think about it and work yourself up but it actually accomplishes nothing. And if I was thinking about it, I was like, I'm not a natural worrier anyway, that's not like my nature. But I was like, so it's almost like I'm creating this feeling that really isn't gonna help me solve the problem. It isn't doing anything but causing me grief and a feeling, and it's really not contributing to the solution which is what most entrepreneurs always have to be, you know, working on. Because in my world, because I've never had a traditional paycheck, I've always created my own businesses, I'm always looking for the solution. And so if I think about worrying versus a solution or a concern, I might have a concern that something's not buttoned up and that I might have to find a solution to fix it. But if I make a decision I'm a very decisive person. I normally am not worried about that decision. I just know that the solution I'm gonna have to come up with if something goes wrong, that that's something I'm gonna have to deal with. So overall worrying, I think if I keep up communication with myself or with the person or the situation, it kind of takes that away. And so now I know some people are built different. They worry all the time and that's just part of their nature. But I'm just just wanted to kind of relay the worry versus concern is thinking if I'm constantly thinking about I hope this person doesn't do that I hope this person doesn't do that I hope the situation gets better I hope this that really doesn't contribute to it other than I made this decision now if it goes this way I have a solution for this or I am confident in my decision that I will find the solution so. I can be heading the right direction. Now, does this mean that I don't worry about when my kids drive away from the house, that I don't think about certain things? Of course I do. But I would just say, if you are somebody that's really working yourself up because of this, try to maybe process it just a little bit different, that all that time spent really doesn't contribute to really making the situation any better. You're just wasting your energy when you could be putting your energy into the solution of making it better. So worry versus concern. I don't know if that made any sense, but that is Daily Fire episode 320. We out.